So as a kid, I loved all the classics, Ninja Turtles, Street Sharks, G.I. Joe, the works. So I really wanted to capture that magic and work with someone that knows exactly what they're doing. So 9 to 5 Warriors is a 90s inspired toy line that aims to recapture the magic of the Saturday morning cartoon era. Everything I've created so far from the animations to the trading cars has been done in the traditional methods of that time period. So when it came to the action figures, it was important to me to retain that authenticity. I went with Scott Hensley, one of the original sculptors of my childhood favorites like Ninja Turtles, Street Sharks, and a lot more. When he created these action figures, he put so much detail into them and that was really important for me to retain. And today, the way the toys are made, they're usually done by 3D sculptors, which gives a lot of flexibilities when it comes to customizations and quick changes. I wanted to find a balance between two. Unfortunately, going the hand sculpted route leaves me with a couple issues like fixing articulation or making any alterations. I started looking for 3D scanning, 3D printing services. I looked everywhere, but unfortunately, either one place does the scanning or the other place does printing and can't do the, the alterations to the 3D files. Thankfully, I found 3D Chimera. We say we work in the 3-3, so 3D printing, 3D scanning, and 3D CAD, anything relating to that. We, so 3D scanning is an incredible technology. We can digitize things from you know, tiny coins and gemstones all the way up to airplanes, and we've actually done all of those kinds of projects before. So when we look at a product that needs some type of 3D scanning, we first start and try and figure out what we're trying to do with that data. So for example, in the case of 9to5 Warriors, we really wanted to utilize a technology that would capture the data, but would also allow it to be easily worked with in very high detail, because this was gonna be replicated with traditional manufacturing to make a toy or figurine that was gonna be sold on the market. And so we chose structured light technology. And in this technology, we're using a three-dimensional pattern that's projected onto the object. And we look at that pattern, and through that, the computer's able to interpret that 3D data in extremely high detail and that's created into a mesh file, and a 3D artist can then take that and create any type of geometry on top of that. That's the same file format that 3D artists use to make your video games and your movies, and so with that file format, they can change expressions, change hand positions, change body positions, and so it's the perfect choice for this particular application. I originally did the 3D scanning myself, so I knew how complicated it was, as well as like the lackluster it results I got by doing it at home. When I worked with them in the studio, it was pretty awesome to see it come to life. They captured all the details that Scott put in, and then I had a workable file, which is the key, because now I can make these changes, I can get them production ready, and see them off to the factory. This is a lifelong dream that's finally coming true, and I can't thank 3D Chimera enough. It's been an absolute honor to work with them, and I'm excited to expand the 9to5 Warrior series line.